we looking? Okay, we are seeing, well, of course, we'll see what we're seeing in a minute. Waiting, 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 waiting. Yes, indeed, I'm waiting. I'm not going to need the essential graphics screen. Project, essential graphics, why don't we edit? Yes, I am. I can close this panel for now, and then I can, well, I guess it doesn't really make it any bigger. That's fine, it's okay. Okay, uh, let's see here. Okay. Okay, so, we are streaming here. I see good, uh, excellent on um, YouTube. It apparently is working. Oh, I need to post this now that I actually have a unified, unified streaming page to make it a lot easier for people. So now people will have their ability to go to either location. I'm doing something a little different tonight as you may be able to, oh, I forgot. I didn't put my Be Right Back screen up. There we go. I should at least try. Why does that look off? Did I accidentally move this? Fit the screen. Okay, no, it says, all right, good. No, uh, wait, what did I just click on? What is this? That is, oh no, that's supposed to be, okay, no, 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 we're good, 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 we're good. okay. Let's try that again. So I'm doing something a little bit different tonight. That's what I was trying to say unsuccessfully. Uh, I'm going to actually, I've been working on which will be released soon, a late night special all about the 1990 to 2000 television series, Beverly Hills 90210, because friend of the show, Brian Korfoff and my wife are big fans of it, and I thought it would be fun. Brian actually had suggested this kind of as a aside during one of our last recordings, or maybe it was in... On, uh, DM somewhere, but I, oh uh, yes, because he had mentioned that one of his go-to shows for rewatching is Beverly Hills 90210, and I said, oh, that's that's funny. My wife watches that show all the time. We should, you know, I think it was the idea was let's do it. Let's do a show where we talk about it for anybody who doesn't know what it is, or <laughs> worst case has perhaps only seen the. Actually, I should check these links. The reboot. Okay, there it is. I do see the live streams right there. Let's go to Twitch. I'm just testing. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I did not. Oops. Uh, I made a mistake. I'm going to fix this right now in the background. Um, I created a unified landing page for the streaming options. And what I just realized is that I forgot to put a... I oh I'm on the wrong account. I am on the wrong account. I need to switch accounts. Uh, there it is. Okay. It's a problem with having all these password managers. You have to have multiple accounts for multiple password managers depending on what you're actually doing. Security can be a lot of work, folks. I don't know if you already knew that. You probably did. If you are doing different security things. It takes some effort. So basically I created a unified landing page on my art site, my Squarespace site. And while I <laughs> had in fact created a link for YouTube, I neglected to put a link to the Twitch channel. So the image is there, but were you to click on it, it would not work. So I'm going to fix that very quickly right now because it should not take any time at all. Go to website. And go to, let's see, uh, website, design. Oh, no, sorry, go back. Pages. Here it is. And we want the streaming page, please. And I need to do edit. And I have to click on this image. And I have to put a link there. No link there. Dummy. That's fine. The good part is I have my Twitch link right here. Actually, I can double check this to make sure it's live. It shows it's live. Excellent. Take that same link that I've now just verified is in fact live and paste that right there. And there we are. Verify that that's still in place. It is. Save. 
and let me reload this page. Page reloaded. That link is now clickable, and it comes to my live feed. Oh, man, it's nice when things are easy. Once in a while, once in a long while, I managed to actually remember how to do th something properly, able to affect the change as needed. Okay, so let's go now to here. Uh, well, I mean, it's still technically an art stream. It's just not going to be artwork tonight. Art stream is live. Go here to pick your platform to watch. That's a good one. Paste. There we are. One site. Man, that is nice to have just one link that does both. Bang! Right there. Let's go here. Bang! Right there. This better work. If I did all this and this doesn't work, I'm going to be, um, well, I'm not thrilled. Uh, paste bang, there it is. Let's go here. Paste bang, there it is. I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't, uh, do I want this? Uh, um, oh, it's voice channels. Okay. Okay, yeah, let's do this. Uh, let's go to here and promo. Done. Here, promote your stuff, paste. God, so many places you have to paste them now. I mean, so many places you have to paste things now. Uh, I, I actually will, I, I mean, some people will probably show up expecting an actual, like, drawing art stream, and that's not what it's going to be tonight. Doing something a little different tonight. A little different. So, where's my phone? Oh, I'm going to post one more place here. But uh, I have uh, decided... I'm gonna do a little bit of video editing this evening because I finally, I'll explain it. I'll explain it when we get to it. Don't worry. All right, add link card. Art stream is live, go here to pick your platform to watch. Actually, that's nice, because it's just the one, the one page. That's actually in many ways better. Hi, cutie. I'm saying hi to my dog. Who's already eaten, so she can't get me with that one tonight. Right? Yeah, no, she did, she did. I'm losing my mind, I'm losing my mind. Paste, post. Post. All right, and we'll go over here, and I will re-post my post. Okay. <laughs> oh, of course, my dog wants to play right now. I have to. Ah, oh, my ear is itching right there. Okay, so let's get going here. I've been dawdling long enough. So we're going to be doing a few things here, but I'll show you where we're starting with. Okay? Let's this fades out. Beautiful. So what you're now seeing, that Walkman's obstructing some of it, I really don't care. You won't care about that part. I've been working on, I did a recording for a 90210 show for the uh, late night series. Oh, I wanna say I did it, we recorded it two or three weeks ago, I can't actually remember now. Uh, my wife, Brian Korfoff, from over at Had Whole Home Video and myself, mostly them, because I was really more of a moderator in this i and this was by design you're not going to hear a lot of me in this show that's actually good i don't need to be talking through every single show all the time i mean when i have something to say i have something to say but i i really wanted to get them together because the two of them like the 90210 show quite a bit and i wanted to give them a platform to talk about it and it was fun for me too just to kind of observe and listen and you know be a what do you call it osmosis fandom on the side and uh, we actually have to insert a thing. So actually, let's let's get into this. Um, you know what? I, there's a bunch of blank space there. It's all the way. Let me move this down a little bit. Oh, whoa, moving the wrong thing. Sorry, I moved the wrong thing. I need to grab this. Let's move this down. There we go, so you can see as much as possible. I mean, not that you're not really missing anything by what's up there. You're, there's, there's really nothing there, uh, but Essentially what I had to do, because here you have it. Now, this is a relatively simple project. I'm not even going to pretend it's not. Compared to some things I've seen people post, I think um, I think the editors of Dune posted their Premiere Pro timeline or whatever, and it looked like something that made me want to cry. This is relatively simple. Basically, it's uh, background. Let's see. This is the background graphics, I believe. Let me see. Can I turn that off? Yeah. 
So basically, this is the static images that change every five minutes. So these backgrounds, I just kind of found a, a seamless wallpaper and have it change every, actually, no, that's gotta be more than five minutes. Oh, no, no, it is every five minutes, but I made blocks of the five minute blocks. So these are actually 45 minutes, five times four or five. So just several different ones that are very 90s inspired. As you see, they change. They're, they're more seamless. I'm bouncing between them, obviously. But that's the, the very bottom background here. And then this repeating thing is I found somebody who had made a very nice seamless VHS graphic, which I'll try to play and see if you can see it. I don't think you're hearing the audio. If you are, sorry about that. But I don't think so. Oh, yeah, see, it's choppy because Premiere, this is how it is. That's normal. It's a lot smoother in practice, but as you can see, there's a the tape moves so that it's not just a static image the whole time. So that's layer two right here. And that's a series of repeating graphics that I pasted about a thousand times. And then here is a VHS sticker, which is that. I made a little sticker uh, in Photoshop, add a little bit of light there to match the shading on the tape used a this pink color from which is to try to match i found some images online of actual uh, 90210 uh, vhs tapes so i tried to get the font somewhat the same this is a similar font and match what the tapes now the tapes in almost every case i saw were vertical but i'm not going to make a vertical tape because that's going to look like it's just going to look like nonsense so i just made a horizontal version you know it's just link for brian's website right there had whole home video which is spelled correctly that's good uh, i could fix that if i had to so guess on the episode my wife and, and brian I, I don't consider myself a guest i'm the host and then you know uh show number is 148 that's why it says catalog number 148 this is in fact the late night number 148 uh, approximately 230 minutes although that's not really true now that i've edited it so i probably that might be the first thing that i fix because the reality is it's going to be about two hours and 20. So let's fix that right now. And if you don't do this very often or aren't familiar with it, the nice part about this stuff is let me switch over to, oh, Faint Waves. Hey, Faint Waves. Uh, yes, good evening. Uh, yes, this was, this is the show I was talking about. I decided to do something different this time. I'm going to get a sip of water. So pardon me for one minute. Uh, I'm going to get a sip of water. There we go. Yes, uh, this is the, the 902 and 0 show. So instead of doing drawing tonight, I I, <laughs> I finished a monumental editing session with this, which I'm going to explain in a minute. But I thought it'd be fun just to kind of go through and you see how I put these pieces together and do this. I don't know. This might be very, very boring. Uh, maybe nobody's going to want to see this. But um, I just realized that I have to refine my VHS sticker because it is no longer a two hour and 30 minute show. So let's activate PlayStation. PlayStation, jeez, I saw PS and I thought PlayStation, not PlayStation. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Let's activate the PlayStation. Here, this is a PlayStation. Oh, boy, I tell you. So the project now is probably, I'm looking at it, right at about two hours and 21 minutes. So I'm just going to say approximately 220 minutes instead of two, 230 minutes. That's not too, oh, God, my math is so off. That's not even right. That wasn't even right. Oh, God. I'm an idiot. <laughs> two and a half hours is not 230 minutes. That's what I put there. I put 230 minutes, meaning two and a half. Oh, God. All right. It's two hours. 60 times two is 120 plus 20. I'm literally using a calculator because this is how bad I am. It's 140 minutes. Good grief. Oh, thank you. Good God. I cannot believe I. That's a good thing I did this. I might not have caught that. So, all right. We're going to just come in here. And because these are all different layers, oh no, does it not have the font? Which font? Helvetica, it's not on this machine? Ay, ay, ay. Hold on. Ah. This drives me crazy. When you have to manage fonts like this, it's so annoying. Isn't Helvetica from the Adobe fonts? I really don't have help. I have to at some point get some kind of like cloud. Uh, oh no, how did I can do it? It's right here. What are they talking about? It was here. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. It was here. Uh oh, let me close this. Say no, don't save. Reopen. This is here. What are they talking about? This, I don't know why. Photoshop's weird with this stuff. So if I go here, it's saying Helvetica new limited standard. Okay, uh, manage. Yeah, don't replace. Oh, don't replace. 
Oh, okay. No. But... I... Oh, wait, here. Okay. Do I not have all the weights in here? Is that what it's trying to tell me? <sighs> okay. You know what? All right. This is this is actually this is actually good. This is a great example of what you do when something stupid like this happens. Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm not altering anything. So I'm gonna come up to an empty space. I'm gonna hit this. I'm gonna put what did I say? Uh, 140. Wow. That's really small. Um, can we? What? Why did it do that? tell you. Photoshop. All right. No, no, that's okay. Uh, new window. Right. Uh, no background. Go back to here. <laughs> tell you. This is what I get for thinking this is going to be easy. I don't know why I ever think that. Nothing is ever easy. That's okay, though. So, one, four, zero. There it is. Okay. We're going to take this number. Because, honestly, I'm not going to worry about this for a friggin' number. I don't care that much. Hevelica new... Okay, so the limited font is not... I mean, come on. That's okay. That's fine. That'll work. Um, I, the size is all wrong, but uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this. I'll fix that in a minute. Move this layer into here. Bang. There it is. See that? There's our number. So now we're going to take that number, right? And I don't think ultra light... Oh, I just banged the mic. Sorry about that. I hit right into it. I heard, my, I heard myself hit it. There we go. That's fine. Now let's match the size to 3 more or less. It doesn't have to be exact, but it's got to be pretty close. Actually, that's a little thick. So it's a little small, it's a little thick. So I think what we want is maybe thin metallic, or thin metallic, th there, right there, thin italic, okay? So size is not right. We'll figure that out. That's no problem. I mean, I can't believe it. I don't know why I say that. I absolutely can't believe it. So what we need to do is, I assume there's no transform adjustments on this. That's okay. Let's see if I can tighten it a little bit this way, because that'll work. I mean, nobody but me is even going to know this or somebody who doesn't watch this. Okay, got it. That's it. So I'm going to take this, and I'm going to put that right about, oh, it's a little bit, it's a little bit big. So I'm going to do a transform a non-uniform transform. We're going to slim it down by doing this. All right? Okay. I mean, I, I'm not worried about it matching exactly, but I want it to be pretty close. Let's get that bottom in. Tight isn't quite right now. There, got it. So now, I'm not even going to save this as a permanent thing. It's just going to be for this. I'm going to save it as, as its own thing. So now I do a new layer. And what I need to do is I need to take... Let's say this on where's the background. There it is. Oh, is it gonna let me do that or not? It did. Okay. Move this down. Okay, can we stretch that down like this? I just need to obscure. I could use a I could use content aware filter if I need to for this. Okay. Alright, there's that. Let's move this up to, I guess, there. You know what? No one's ever going to be able to notice that. I mean, it's it's off a little, but I can fix that by just doing this. But no reasonable person is going to notice this on the background of a tape thing. They're just not. And I mean, there's a part of me that that bristles at that. Because you can, you can see it, right? You can see a little bit that there's something there. Uh, yeah, see, if I really zoom in, see how you can see the gradient is different? I mean, but the nice part is I can take some of that out because the number doesn't go all the way over there. Oh, not that far, though. Yeah, see, there, this is the tricky bit. Right? So this is where it's like, ah, I gotta be so careful. I'm gonna shave it just right. But again, I can't worry that much about it. I think I might be able to just, uh, what do you call it? I mean, I am worried. This is so much more worrying than is necessary. Oh, there we go. There we go. Look at that. Got it. I got it. That's close enough. Zoomed out. No normal human being is going to see it at the size they're going to see it. Right? So I could sit here for 10 hours and try to get that right. Or I could just say, save a copy. Right? 
And then inside the folder, that's called what? Uh, that is called VHS sticker. So VHS sticker is gonna be down here. VHS sticker is a ping file. Now watch this. If you've done this before, you're, this is not going to be magical to you at all. So I'm about to hit save. <clears throat> Let's jump back to the project. So if I turn Photoshop off, now you see the sticker there, right? Uh, well, it's, it's kind of zoomed out. So let me do this. Let me say zoom to 200%. No, no more. Let's do 400%. Okay, so this is one of the best things. All right, I'm going to hit save. Now you're not going to see me hitting save because I'm doing it in the other screen. But I'm going to hit save, replace, okay. Give that a minute. And now it's 140 minutes, which is more accurate. So, and again, at normal size, which is, you know, I'm doing this on a 4K screen, so this is pretty close to what you'll see on your, you're not gonna see that. You're not gonna see it. And now I fixed that stupid thing that I did wrong. So I do like the fact that Adobe has all this, you know, that the, the dynamic file linking, all that stuff works. So, okay. What I was planning to do on Photoshop, not that, was I wanna do more of these cards, the 90210 cards. So, what I'm going to do is, because I want to have them changing, um, you know, just periodically, I'm going to have the cards, like another card will cover this one, you know, as it goes on. Not too many times. I, I do it the first time when there's like a musical stinger, which is where the music plays. I don't think you can hear this. Tell me if you can. I doubt you can, but you'll see it. I'll hear it. <clears throat> Hold on. Are you hearing me talking? I doubt it. I'm going to guess you're not. Not, not, not me talking, but the video. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think you can hear that. So the first, the first time the cards appear is when the music, the theme music plays for about five seconds because I can't play anymore or YouTube's going to get me on it. They'll probably get me on it anyway for something. Uh, but I want to have more of these cards kind of, I want the cards to kind of come in as the backgrounds change. Or not as the backgrounds change, but every... I don't know, I'm gonna say 10 minutes. So I have, let me switch this back to Photoshop. There we go. I don't need this any, I don't need you anymore. You can go away. Don't save, leave the original. That's fixed. So now in the background, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go to desktop, go to 9 uh, and open the Dylan card, open in Photoshop and you should see that appear momentarily okay so there's our Dylan card and what I want to do is I know there's more of these cards so I want to get some different ones just with different characters because uh, just so there's something a little bit interesting uh, trading cards trading cards I'm not gonna have every single thing I'm doing showing up here you're gonna be bouncing through 80 windows you'll see what I'm talking about in a second but that's this is the card we're gonna be altering right there so let's see, there's one. So I already have one. Let's see, are there any of, <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> oh boy. We, we do spend a, a, a number of minutes talking about the character Andrea. So I'm gonna put her in here. Character who, oh, okay, I do need to have it uh, unified for that. Uh, a character that we joke about because this this actress was too old to be playing this character when the show was on, and yet they kept her on for a very long time. Not her fault. I mean, they, they cast her. It's, it's a job. Take a job where the job is. So I'm certainly not blaming the actress, but oh boy, did they not do this character any favors. They really didn't. Um, so let's see. I just want to, I want these to be pretty close. They don't have to be exact, but I don't want them to be too far off so that they look like they're, okay, that should be fine. Just so that they're similar enough. Okay, there we have an Andrea card. So we will go ahead and do a file, save a copy. And I think those are ping files. They are because I need the transparent. Well, these don't have transparency, but uh, yeah, Dylan, oh no, they're JPEGs. Oh, I saved them as JPEGs. Okay, well, that's fine. So we'll call this, uh, Andrea card, there we go, save. So now we will jump back to our 
premiere window and we will go to oh i don't know i guess i will do it every five minutes it's about when the background changes too right Let me see where that background change happens. It's probably not a bad idea to do it at the background change. Let's see where the first background it should be around five minutes, or is it three minutes? I don't even remember. It's got to be around five. Oh, oh, there it was. Let's see where exactly is it here. Oh, it just happened. Okay, so it just happened. I'm trying to time that is going to be tough, I think. Okay, so it's at about five minutes. Hmm. Trying to time that is going to be stupid. So guess what? If it's happening every five minutes, it is going to happen every five minutes, but not the way that that five minutes is happening. It's going to actually happen. So let's go from the beginning, which is right there. So five minutes from the beginning but we want to do it oh god i'm not gonna to try to calculate that all right let's do it at i'm i'm making way more work for myself than is at all necessary but that's how i do things all right so we're gonna make it two and a half minutes from here which would be one zero three oh is that right no wait that can't be right that's not five minutes that's frames this is the other thing as i never i never can get on board with the way that premiere does stuff is that is that two and a half minutes? No, it can't be. It can't be. Because the duration of this... It, no, this is not... This is not five minutes. Or this is not eight minutes. Idiot. So what we want to do is... Five minutes would be... You know what? Yeah, why not? I don't, I don't have to be beholden or anything like that. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to put the card right there. So this is... This is this is how bad I am at this. Just so everybody's aware. I am not good at this. At all. And you're getting a very clear picture of that right now. So we're going to have to add some tracks. I'm sure real video editors who know what they're doing are, are if anybody, if anybody who's a real video editor ever watches this, they will be horrified. Horrified by what I'm doing here. And, and I don't blame them. They, they will they will just be like why 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 would anyone do it this way why wouldn't you learn how to do this the right way because honestly um i don't know because i'm an idiot that's why i should learn how to do this the right way but um i probably won't i could lie and say yeah i will but the reality is i'm it, it works well enough for what i'm doing and i guess it's one of those things that uh, I don't say that to be a positive thing. It's not good to be that way. But I know how I'm built. You know? And that's what most of us are do is, you know, if something works, we just stick with it because it works. So I can pretend that I'm not that way, but I am that way. So yeah, I'm just being honest about it. Okay, so we have another card that's going to come in. Um, and I'm just going to have it like it shows up. I'm not going to do any transition for it. I'll just have it pop in. Cause it's kind of like somebody's dropping a card I, oh i guess i could do a zoom in thing and have it like the cards dropping wow could i do that hold on all right maybe hold on i'm thinking in my head this is so much over engineered work for this okay <laughs> would this would that even work if you were to drop a card from the frame of your eye it would okay you know what why not why just sit here and do something boring? Why not try something, even if it's going to be a spectacular failure? Why not give it a shot? So let's let's try it. Um, I don't think it's going to work, but I'm going to try it anyway. Let's just see. So if the card was being dropped from a height, right? We have to put a scale on it, and the scale initially is going to have to start. so terrible <laughs> this is awful uh why 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 would anybody do this okay so <laughs> you know what why not let's just see so we'll start <laughs> <I've>... <laughs> all right and then by the time we get to the end 
right here. We want it to be at one, uh, 55, like that. Okay, so let's see how that looks in motion. Oh no, that, that can't possibly, is that taking that long? Oh no, 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 this has to be quick. This has to be quick. This cannot take this long. Oh, that's, that's hell on earth. Oh no, that's, whoa, that's way too slow. This has to be like somebody's dropping a card. So I would say by this, this has to be done. There we go. Let's see what that looks like. That's, oh, I'm too far back. That's more like what I'm trying to do. Let's see what this looks like. Let me zoom this in a little bit. Okay, well, I think that's stuttering because it's rendering, which is a problem, a common problem. Maybe not. Yeah, it has to be. It's got to be because it's, it, or maybe I, I'm not thinking about how long this is taking. Well, Wow, is it really that? It is, it's that long. Jeez, this has got to be really quick. Okay. Okay, hold on. Oh yeah, no, this can't take this long. I, I don't know what I was thinking. All right, no problem. So we're gonna say three seconds, so let's jump to three. Okay, let's drag this in. There we are, let's see how that looks. Eh. It still seems like it's taking a while, so maybe we'll do two seconds. Uh, so let's go to three. Oh, that is that is two seconds. Wow. You know what? Actually, I don't mind that now that I just looked at it. That's okay. I mean, it looks like a card being dropped. It does. It does look like that. Okay. Uh, let me do ease out. Well, let me see. Let me see what that does. Let's see what this does. I don't mind that, actually. Now, the other thing is, because a card that close to you wouldn't... Uh, what's the word for it? It wouldn't be that clear, right? It would be blurred. So, let's do a Gaussian blur. Uh, and we'll put that right on Andrea here. I was about to say old Andrea, but that's me. I don't want to do that. So blurriness at first has to start off very blurry. So maybe like that. Now this is the trick. I don't really know how to judge blurriness. So at this point, I would say zero. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, here we go. Oh, well, okay, I gotta let it render. But actually I think Geez, did I actually manage to make this look convincing? Wow. Wow, it doesn't look bad. It looks like what I thought in my head. That's a rarity. Hold on. Okay, the only other thing is I need to... Huh. I need to... It should look dark and it should lighten up as it drops. Um, huh. How do you do that? How do I do levels? How would I do like a level? Oh, there it is, adjust levels. Holy, wow. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, let's see, what does this do? Oh yeah, well. Um, actually, I guess it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be levels, it would be brightness. It'd probably be brightness brightness and contrast right there okay yeah yeah let's let's try that not really it's not really the levels it's the brightness oh yeah okay all right hold on so if we set brightness to i guess minus 100 that's all it lets me do and then go to zero oops okay let's see what this looks like this is hysterical Yeah, no, I think it's going to look right. I mean, it looks weird, but if you think about the logic of it, 
that makes sense. And then it lightens up, and then as it hits, it's the right thing. Yeah, that, that's right. That's it. Wow. That's hysterical. That is hysterical. Okay. No, that's that's it. That's the effect I want. That is that is in fact what I want to happen. I actually made it look pretty much like what I wanted. Which doesn't happen often. But I managed to do it. Unbelievable. I am going to reward myself with a drink of water. That's only taken me 35 minutes. Okay. Well. Onward we go. So, all right, that's another reason why I'm not going to have too many of these cards. i got to redo this effect every single time now. Just, can I actually replace the file? Can I replace the file? That would make it so much easier. No, you can't. No, you can't do a replace file. I didn't think so. That would be way, way, way too easy. Whatever, that's okay. All right, so now, now though, I'm gonna do this every five minutes. So beginning with Andrea's card. Am I hit the right thing? Andrea's right there. So she's at 501.30. So now we'll jump to five. Wow, do I use every five minutes? Huh. Okay, every five minutes. Five into 140. How many cards would I need? Hold on a minute. I might do this every 10 minutes. This is a lot of work. Hold on. 140 divided by five is 28. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, no we're not doing that. Uh, it is not going to be every 10 minutes because I'm not that crazy. I'm really not. Um, I'm really not. You know what? 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 Okay. Hold on a minute. Now that I think about it, it is really dumb. I'm just making things difficult on myself if I just don't make this an even five minutes right here. Why not? What is the difference? What is lost by doing that? Nothing. Oh no, does that move the thing? Never mind. Don't, don't do that. Move this. There we go. Now my stuff stays. Badoo! Perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. So now, uh, go to the beginning. Yeah, I was, I was just, I was just about to make my life more difficult than it needed to be for no real reason, no real good reason, I should say. Okay, so, um, you know what I really need? Nope, I'm fine. Okay, so we've got Andrea. I have Brandon. Brenda, Dylan, who else? Where's Steve? We need Steve. I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't, there's not a picture of uh, Brandon, Brand, I, I don't know what I was trying to say. Brandon and Brenda, oh, I need Kelly. Yeah, where's Kelly? Where is, uh, where's Kelly and all this? It's not really fair not to have Kelly, is that Kelly? Oh, oh, oh that's, I don't know. I, would like a nicer picture of Kelly. I mean, it's not a bad picture of her, but it's kind of. I don't know. Maybe it's better than that one. Jeez, this is when they were trying to really. Wow. Yeah, you're stretching there, guys. Um... Oh God, I will use that one of Steve because he's such a, a himbo. That's a nice one of Kelly. Jeez, all the Kelly ones are kind of oversexed. I mean, it's fine, but you know, I, that first one, it's very 90s. I'll use the first one. It's fine. I'm, I'm overthinking this. Where's that first one? Kelly, uh, I lost it. Where'd it go? Kelly, would not that one. Where'd the other one go? Uh, where is the other Kelly one? I just saw it. Oh, there it is, right there. Okay, here we go. All right, let's do a copy. Jump to Photoshop. So back to Photoshop. And now I think I can probably use the Andrea card as a guide on this, hopefully. Let's see, there's the edge. Okay. 
Uh, okay, well, it's almost there. It's not quite there. I gotta move this over a bit. The, yeah, so it's not gonna be perfect, but it's 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 close. It gives me a good sense. It's workable enough. Okay, uh, go there. Scroll down a bit. I do apologize if this is terrifically boring. It might be. I don't know. I didn't know if anybody would just want something that was a change of pace. Colors on that look off. I don't know if auto anything's gonna do. Yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. Yeah. I'm, I'm overthinking this. Okay, so Kelly. Kelly deserves her own car because Kelly is the best character in the show. As my wife says, and the more I watch the show, even from the sidelines, it becomes very obvious that she is absolutely the best character in the show. Okay, so let's go to the 90210 folder. Let's find Kelly's card. Where is. Oh, wait a minute. Where are these? Oh, I just realized that. I was not saving these in the right spot. That's okay. It won't hurt anything. I just have to fix this. I was saving them. That's another problem of mine. I was saving this into the old 90210 folder, not the new one. So anyway, it's fine. Let's put Kelly right there. Let's dial this in so that I can zoom in wait are you seeing that you're not seeing that sorry turn that off there's okay so now you can see it let's bring this to right there zap that way out okay so now with kelly we have to do the exact same things that we did with andrea's card so with andrea's card i have to look at what i did so andrea starts off at a ridiculous size which is 600 and ends up at 55. So Kelly must do the same. So Kelly right here starts off just like that. Scale of, oh, wait, not yet. Don't do that yet, don't do that. I have to get the positioning right. I have to position her first because otherwise it's not gonna fall in the right spot. So at 55, there we are, Kelly needs to be uh, we're going to slightly tilt, bring this up here. We're going to move Kelly over a little bit more. And we'll do a bit of a rotation on her. The other way, please. So she's kind of mirroring Dylan there. Okay, perfect. Now, now, we go to 600. And that's scale one. And then, what did I say? It's two seconds in. At two seconds, she's at 55. There we go. Now, we have to do the same thing as far as, I gotta look at the blurring. The blurring on Andrea at first is what? She's at 11 blurriness and minus 100 brightness. Got it. 11 and 100. I got it. Okay, Kelly, you're up. So Kelly, get the brightness there. Brightness, minus 100. Let's bring this way in. There we are. Go here. And she will be at, uh, well, I guess standard is 100. Oh, no. Wait, is standard zero? Standard zero. Thank you. Sorry about that. Okay. And then we need the blur. And the Gaussian blur at the beginning. Come on. There we are. Gaussian blur at the beginning. So we do blurriness. And we say 11. And then by the time we get to here, we are at a nice zero. So 11 to zero. Let's check it. OK, so there it is. Why is the brightness not up right? Brightness where it's supposed to be. There it is. Okay. Oh wait, did I not do minus 100? That's probably why. Okay. There is probably, by the way, I would bet money that somebody has a pre-built effect that does this exact thing so that I wouldn't have to do all this. But you know what? To some degree, this is a good way to learn a tool. 
So even though this may not be the smartest way to do this, I don't mind that I'm doing it. But there probably is someone who has built a tool that does this exact thing. And so a lot of this, you could probably just go to Adobe Stock and you could probably find somebody who's built this exact, like a card drop effect, and it would save you a bunch of time. I, I have no doubt that exists. So uh, if you don't wanna have to do all this, if this looks like a horror show to you, I am positive that you could find somebody who's done this. So don't, don't think for a minute that you have to do this. This tone is wrong. That's better, but it's still, he's so yellow. Why is he so yellow? That's got to be a hue thing I can fix. Let's try it. Can I fix that? God. It's also way oversaturated. I mean, that's that's the cards I know, but actually, you know what? I can leave the... I don't mind the card part being really loud, but he just looks like an alien. Maybe I just need to drop his saturation down a bit. He just doesn't look like a human being. I mean, it's a playing card. I know it's going to be a little... Okay, that's fine. So save a copy. And this will be David card. And I have to check where I'm saving it because I know I'm saving it in the wrong spot. So we'll just go ahead and see Thunder. Uh, podcast, now 210. And save and save. And then we'll come back to Premiere. And turn that off. And then we're going to bring David in. David, David card, right? Yes, I mean, I have to move it, but it's right. Here we go. All right, so now David needs a blur. David needs a brightness. And I have to position him. So let's position him first at 55, please, because that's what he's going to be at. And actually, uh, since I've done all these other ones like this, I'm going to put David in the center, just to give it a little bit of difference. Uh, okay, so then David needs to go to 600 scale. Then we need brightness to be minus 100. Or sorry, blurriness needs to be 11. Bang. Brightness minus 100. Bang. Okay, now we know we have to come two seconds in. And at two seconds, we have to go to 55. There we are. We have to go to zero. There we are. And we have to go to zero. And now we should have the same exact effect. David, we've got a couple times to let me render it out. Go to five, we got it right. Yep, okay, so there's David. Now, I could put drop shadow. I'm not going to go that crazy. I am not going to go that crazy. I could, but honestly, I, I believe I am putting in enough effort for what is essentially a video that, you know, it's just to have some differentiation in the background. But it really doesn't matter. I will have to do end credits, but I'm not going to do those in the stream because I'm already at 50 minutes. Yeah, so I'm not going to do this forever. I do. I, this will drive me crazy if I keep doing it. So, <clears throat> 10 minutes is, we'll go to 35 minutes. And maybe I'll do the Steve card and that will be the end of the stream for tonight. All right, let's go get our Steve card. I'm gonna switch Photoshop back on so we can see what we're doing. There's Steve's terrible card. There it is. Yes, indeed. Let's grab that card. Oh boy. Oh boy. Paste. Oh, Steve. Stevie, Stevie, Stevie. Let's try to even those edges out, shall we? There we go. That gets rid of that harsh edge. He also, these, they all look yellow. All these people look so friggin' yellow. I think it's just they, they, they're so blown out. Let me just pull his saturation down. I think that'll make it look a lot better. Yeah, see, that, that at least looks, I mean, it looks a little desaturated, but that's the point, because he just looks so friggin' yellow. Good grief, man. Save the copy. Whew. Okay, this will be Steve. Whoop. Spelling. It's important. 
Spelling is important, Steve Card. Save. Okay. And now we're going to switch off of Photoshop. We're back to Premiere. And let's get Steve. Where's Steve? Why don't I see Steve? Did it save him in the wrong place again? I thought I saved it. Uh, no, I didn't. Hold on. Yeah, I saved it in the wrong spot again. Sorry, give me a minute. Because my folders are all duplicated, I thought I was in the right place because the name looked the same, but I, in fact, did not. It's okay. All right, let's get this uh, dialed. Let's get this dialed in. Yes, that's what I mean. I'm starting to get loopy. Looking at Premiere for a while, we'll do that to you. Believe me when I tell you, if you've never worked in Premiere, looking at it for a while, it's going to make you nuts. I love the program. I do. I mean, it lets me do stuff that, like I said, I'm sure real video editors would watch this and be horrified. But for what I'm doing, you know what? It does what I need it to do. That's not necessarily the greatest endorsement for a program. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tilt Steve... Let's see how this looks. Just tilt them a little bit that way. Because I've been tilting them all in kind of the same directions. So what happens if I tilt Steve a little bit differently? Move him down a bit. Like that. There we are. Okay. That's good. All right. So let's do. Here we go. 600. Bang. Yep. Uh, brightness. Minus 100. Bang. Blur, 11, bang. All right, we come in two seconds, and then we're at 55, bang. We're at zero, zero, and there we go. Yep, okay, okay, hold on. Yep, that should work. Let's take a look. There's a lot going on. That's why it's it's struggling. I, Premiere just does this. And the background changed. Wow, I actually lined that up really well. Okay, so you can see how it will actually look. It'll look good. I mean, it'll look good for what I'm trying to do. I'm not saying it's going to really look good. But... Yeah, it'll, it, it's working. It's doing what I want it to do. This is gonna this is gonna be a lot of things. Remember how I was saying Dune had a lot of stuff? This is gonna have a lot too. Not as many as Dune. But anyway. Let's let's do myself a favor and save. That's always important. Okay. You know what? Uh yeah, 53 minutes. I think I am I think I am done with this stream for tonight. Uh, I liked doing this though. I should say. I did enjoy doing this. But yeah, premieres a lot. So I hope you, you enjoyed something a little different because this was something a little different. Um, yeah, from time to time I will do something a little different. Uh, so anyway, uh, premiere is a lot of work, but it can be a lot of fun. So this this video will be up, I believe, next week. So I'm aiming to have this up next week, probably Monday of next week from when I'm recording this, which will be April first I want to say of 2024 so I'm almost done I just got into these little details and of course as they say the devil is in the details but I'm a long way I'm very very close to being done so I am confident I can finish it this week so on that note thank you for coming by and watching and uh seeing the process nothing nothing staged here this is I did not anticipate running that sticker problem nothing this is how it goes a lot of times so you've gotten a very direct window into what this is like for me. So it's fun. I like doing it. It can be a challenge at times. But um, thank you for stopping by and watching the stream. Go watch somebody else's stream and experience some creativity or do some of your own, whatever it is, Premiere or Photoshop or whatever. And uh, until the next stream, thanks for stopping by.